to is uh, have a talk about history. How do you feel about that? Good. Good. Alright, who likes history? Terrific. <laughs> Terrific. Okay. Ah, last class was very good as well. Now, why do you like history? Because of the people. Because of the rules of facts. Yes. Yes. in due course, but okay, good question, I will be using them, and you will be possibly, might be you, okay, all right, so the history of Melbourne, I want you to think about this point I'm going to make now, that history is often also made by ordinary people, ordinary people, by that I mean people who aren't famous, who don't have rich parents, who don't have gone to university, ordinary people make history, and at any time in your life it could happen to you. You could become part of history. And this story, we'll show you that and I'll come back to that at the end. So do you think you remember that? Try and remember that point. I'm All right, I'll, I'll ask you at the end. Now, all right, we'll start history moment. Right, we'll go back to 1803. We're not going to be concerned with Sydney, the first leader in convicts at all. Uh, we are talking about Melbourne. It's a very specific, special story of its own. And uh, a good point is 1803. 